Oh, hi. I didn't see you there. I was actually just thinking a little bit about all the different types of ways that we've been analyzing data and how we've been looking at data. And there are two real ways that we can do this. The first is what's called qualitative analysis, and the other is called quantitative analysis. And as I was going through my desk drawer, I found some little ping pong balls that I used to have some fun with when I was a kid. So I thought we'd maybe we'd take a look at these and explain a little bit about how we can make some analysis or make some observations. So for example, a qualitative analysis, you think of the word quality, right? So qualitative would be something like that these ping pong balls are white or that they're round or that they have little tiny stars on the end of them. That is a qualitative analysis. Now, otherwise, we have also what's called a quantitative analysis. And Quantitative is like the word quantity, meaning number. So as long as I have a number with that observation, that would be a quantitative analysis. So for example, I have six ping pong balls here, or the ping pong balls are one inch in diameter. So there's a difference between qualitative, quality, and quantitative, meaning like number. So for example, if I threw these all up in the air, I say these ping pong balls are all over the floor, and that would be a qualitative analysis. Now, if you'll excuse me, I gotta go pick these up. 